Strata living can be a friendly way to live in a small community, but it's completely different to living in a freestanding house. And it's important you know your roles and responsibilities, whether you're the strata owner, the tenant, the real estate agent, or the managing agent. A strata scheme is a residential building or a collection of buildings where individuals each own a small part, usually their apartment or townhouse. This small part is technically called a lot. There are other parts of a strata scheme including a building or property and these parts are jointly owned by all the lot owners. These parts are called common property and include things like foyers, stairways, lifts, gardens and driveways. When you buy an apartment or townhouse in a strata scheme, you are actually buying into a community where you own your lot and you share ownership of the common property and facilities with others. This is very different to buying and owning a freestanding home where you own the land and all of the buildings on the property and you make all the decisions about maintaining that property yourself. In a strata scheme, you share the responsibility and cost of maintaining the common property with others. In New South Wales, the strata legislation governs the way that strata schemes are run. Under that legislation, every strata scheme must have its own set of bylaws. Bylaws stipulate if and how you can renovate your unit, where you can or cannot park your car, where you can dry your washing, or if you're allowed to keep pets. Strata owners can agree to make new bylaws or change existing ones to suit the needs of their strata community. It's really important that anyone thinking about buying into a strata scheme understands that these rules exist and must be followed. If someone buys into a strata scheme and chooses to ignore the bylaws, it's likely that this will upset other residents and may lead to significant friction and an unpleasant living environment. In most strata schemes, people live harmoniously. They cooperate, they work together to share the responsibility for managing their scheme. One of the keys for successful living in strata schemes is for lot owners to get involved. If you are actively involved in running a scheme, you're going to be in a better position to influence decisions about what goes on and the things that are important to you. All strata owners are automatically members of the Owners' Corporation and have the right to participate in the corporation's decision making. The Owners' Corporation are required to hold an annual general meeting every year and it's important to attend, so get involved. All strata owners have to contribute to the cost of maintaining the scheme's common property. This is done by paying a set amount of money every three months called a levy. The amount of the levy each owner pays is worked out on a yearly basis by the owner's corporation. The levies include amount that is set aside for future expenses. For example, there's the administration fund which pays for things like insurance and the repairs and, and maintenance around the common property. Then there's the sinking fund which is for major items of capital works like replacing the roof. Before you buy, it's essential that you check out things like the bylaws for your particular scheme, is there a history of disputes? How much are the levies? Is the insurance up to date? What repairs are required around the building? About 60% of strata schemes have managing agents to help them sort out their affairs. The managing agent works for the owner's corporation and carries out their decisions, such as organising repairs, issuing meeting and levy notices, keeping accurate accounts and paying insurances. A managing agent must be licensed under the Property Stock and Business Agents Act 2002. The vast majority of strata schemes operate without any problems, but strata living often brings people of different interests and backgrounds together. Disagreements and disputes sometimes occur in strata schemes. The most common ones are pets, parking and noise. However, these can often be resolved by talking about it. If a strata scheme cannot resolve a dispute by themselves, an owner, owner's corporation or tenant can apply to Fair Trading who has qualified and skilled mediators who are happy to assist. For more information about strata living in New South Wales, go to New South Wales Fair Trading website at www.fairtrading.nsw.gov.au where you can order the strata living booklet, download fact sheets or phone 133220.